Hey everyone, Daniel from Twin Bytes with another tutorial for you, and this time I'm going to show you how to browse a backup image file. So if you used, in this case, we had Macrom Reflect to back up the computer and we created an image file. Now if you want to restore the entire image as it was, I have another video that shows you the entire process of backing up and restoring, which I'll link to down below in the description. But in this case, if we want to just browse the individual files, I'm going to show you how to do that here. So if you look up your backup drive and you'll see your file, it shows you the date when it was done. You can right click on it and in Windows 11, it's got Explore Image. You also have Show More Options and here we got Explore Image as well. But you may find in Windows 10, it'll say Macrom Reflect and then to map a drive but in this case we just have the explore image so you'll have the option to choose what you want to map to so in this case here I've got uh, my C drive I can see that's very clear that's most likely what you're going to be looking for there's going to be other system files recovery partitions and that which you won't care about most likely you may also have another drive like I'm showing here in this case is a D drive for data now you can see that it assigns a drive letter so when we select C to browse it's going to show up as our H drive if I was to select the other one here as well then that would show up as I I'm just going to keep the C drive for now and we're going to map that you also may have to choose to enable access to restricted folders otherwise you may not gain access to certain folders so then we'll hit OK it assigns the drive letter and then it opens it up so now in our H drive which we're looking at we can see what used to be our C drive and then you can just browse here to find what you're looking for if you're looking for your data it's going to be under users and then you'll see your username and then you'll see all your standard things such as your desktop documents downloads there's your music and your pictures and videos so that's where most of those things are you may have other things if you go back to the map drive letter which will be a different letter for you possibly there's your program files for different programs and there may be a program data in here as well unless in my case it's mapped to the other drive and that's where you will find different data that might be important for certain programs that you are trying to restore or games even and you want to get your game data so all that stuff would be in here somewhere and it's just as simple as right clicking on any particular folder going in to copy it and then go back into your C drive and paste it in that same location. Once you're done with this, if you go back to your main screen here, you can probably even do it right from here, but uh, when you see the drive letter, you can right click on that. Windows 11, we'll go to show more options. Here's our Macrom Reflect. Now we can go to unmount the Macrom image and you'll see that it disappears and that's it we're back to where we started again so that's it for this tutorial i hope you did find it helpful if you did please do give it a thumbs up consider subscribing even better give it a super thanks and thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one bye for now